Colossians 2, 17. These festivals and rules, these are a shadow, a shadow of the things that were to come. The reality, however, is found in Christ. These religious festivals and rules, they were a shadow. But now reality is Jesus. I have these pictures that I brought. I have pictures all over my house of my family because I love my family. I think my wife and kids are incredible. I know your family's nice and all too, but like I look at these pictures every day. I'm like, oh, look at how cute the girls were. She's so smiley. She used to be cute. Sorry. Uh, and then I look. I'm like, I know you guys can't see, but they're tiny there. I'm like, they're so cute. And I've got another picture around here somewhere. And I'm like, oh, look at this Disneyland. I love my family. We just love Disneyland. We love going to Disneyland and having fun. And it's like right in the beginning of the teenage years. And then Christmas. Christmas is like our favorite time of year. Look at that beautiful wife right there. You got Jody, Ashlyn, Sydney. Now, you have no problem with me looking at these pictures and just adoring them. But then what if you came in here on a Sunday and I'm talking to them like, Hey, babe, how you doing? Look at our beautiful girl. Sydney, how's school today? Oh, Ashlyn, you going to be going to that dance soon? Yeah, keep, tell the boy keep his hands to himself. Oh, girls, you, the, how's it going today? You're so cute. You'd be like, Nick's losing it. Even worse, though. Even worse, because what if I told you, look, I just miss my family. I like looking. Okay, okay, okay. But then all of a sudden, Jody and the girls walk in, and they're standing here. Hey, babe. Hey, Dad. I'm like, shh, I'm talking. Hey, babe, how's it going? How's school today, Sydney? Ashlyn, are you, have you been studying for chemistry? Hey, girl. And they're like, uh, hello. I'm like, shh, I'm talking to my family. Thank you. Hey, hey. And all of a sudden, you're like, yeah, he's way lost it. That's what Paul is saying. Those are shadows. And when you keep focusing on them, you're missing the very real and present Jesus. He's like, I'm right here. You don't have to do all those things. In fact, you will do all those things because I encompass all those things. Follow me. We have a purpose now to follow Jesus. We have freedom in Jesus. We no longer have a faith of do's and don'ts and rules. Don't eat, don't touch, don't look, don't say. But rather we have a faith that says, I get to now. I get to act like and be like and shine for Jesus. I get to. It's so different than what I was. I don't have to do anything. I get to do a lot of cool things now. I get to say, say uh, good and encouraging things to people that put smiles on their face and puts a smile on God's face instead of gossipy, complainy things. I get to do this. I'm not told do not. I get to. I get to serve and give to others instead of just myself. I get to look at my beautiful wife only and not the disgusting things I see on TV or the internet. I get to love others instead of having bitterness and anger in my heart. I get to think about the good and glorious Savior that is supreme over all things that loves me and died for me so that I could be brought back to him. And I get to share this with others in my daily life. I don't have to. Hey, you should evangelize. You have to. I have to nothing. That's like telling me I have to go kiss my wife. <laughs> okay, I get to. I get to serve this Savior. The follower of Christ doesn't have to follow the rules. The follower gets to follow Jesus. And today we celebrate that truth in communion. That's our focus for this week. Every week we're fo focusing on a different aspect of communion. We get to share in this very small meal the reminder that Jesus is very real, very alive, and very present, and very inside of us, and not just a shadow of things to come. It points to a specific point in time where he says, here I am. No longer do you have to do all the things. You'll listen to all the voices and follow all the rules. Follow me, and you'll naturally follow rules.